Hello all, welcome to another video. Uh, unfortunately uh, for some, uh, this is going to be another video on um, the LiPo battery. And I'm, I'm not really here to want to teach people to suck eggs, but it's something I've noticed as well. Um, again, you guys probably already may already know about them, um, but it's really something for people to be aware of. The LiPo battery, despite you know, moving on a lot in the last uh, 5, 10, 15, 20 years uh, is still very complex and if you don't treat them right you're still going to get some form of issues and the issue to me at the moment uh, is something that I've come across where if you've been following my videos over the last couple of months you'll notice that uh, my scout was grounded for a while whilst i updated the gps and whilst i worked out what the issue was why it wasn't powering up cor correctly and all the time uh, that was happening uh, the battery wasn't doing anything it was sitting there i'd had it pretty much fully charged and uh, it was sitting there so after the last couple of flights that I've done, after all my upgrades, I have noticed that the duration of the flights is nowhere near what it used to be. You know, you would be talking maybe sort of 16 to 18 minutes. Um, I'm struggling now to get 10. And basically, these batteries do not like sitting around for weeks, probably months, without actually being used and they will slowly start to deplete. Um, what you've got is a LiPo which needs to be constantly used, but there come, also comes a point where if you've used it, say, I don't know, um, through something like 70 cycles, it will also uh, start to play up. So, advice really is never have the battery fully charged and leave it lying around. Um, always best to try and discharge it or put it into storage mode and um, in which case it sort of saves it. The, this battery is not damaged, it's just not lasting anywhere near what it should do and um, you know through my own fault my own it means that I'm not getting as I say anywhere near the duration. So that's really my tip uh, if you're going to store your scalp for a while, whether it be maybe for winter or because it's got an issue, um, think about the lipos first. Um, and uh, if, if you want to spend um, 150 US dollars on a new one, that's fine. Um, but uh, in my opinion, uh, it's better to be safe than sorry and, and, and put it into a storage mode or just reduce its capacity uh, down. Um, but when I'm charging it, everything's fine. Uh, and when I'm putting it in the scout, everything seems fine, but it just depletes very quickly whilst it's in the air. So that's my tip. Um, I'm just gonna uh, add a video of my flight, which I took sort of dusk time. And you'll see, I'll do a very sort of fast forwards and you'll see from the time it takes off to the time it lands, that's pretty much um, all I got from, the, from this battery. So thank you for watching. Uh, another video of mine and um, I will get back to you uh, again soon with more videos and um, please do visit my website dronesco.uk uh, which has with a uh, shop there now so you can buy if you want to buy an additional battery you can do as well as various other parts that you can buy and um, I will catch up with everyone and you all very very soon take care and I'll see you soon